Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel. As most of you know, I'm Topher. And for those of you who don't know and just randomly decided to click on my video, welcome to the channel. I'm Topher. Thank you for stopping by. So it is November. October is officially over, and I figured it is time for a channel update video. Yes, I just gave you October's update video a couple weeks ago, but I was late, and I'm trying not to be late. So I'm trying to be early this month. Um, not too, too many things to update. We had a couple of series of polls over both on the community tab of my YouTube channel and on my Patreon. So I'll reveal those results in a second. Um, but yeah, uh, October was a the start of what's going to be a busy fall winter season. Um, it gets this way every year. Fall into winter and then spring into summer are like the two busiest times of the year, both at work and just for me with shows. Um, that's usually when I'm going in and out of town with a bunch of gigs. Um, yeah, so it's like it's it's it, it's 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 the start of busy season. Um, so you may have noticed um, throughout October and maybe even a little bit in September, um, the I guess consistency of my uploads on YouTube anyway, kind of fluctuating. Um, I try to keep it like you know a, a video every day um, of something, but there are just some days where I'm like. I just I haven't edited something or I haven't had time to make a thumbnail or you know come up with a video description or you know this that the other so like there are some days that just you know nothing got uploaded to YouTube um, I try to keep those days few and far between but they they they've, they've the numbers crept up a little bit over the last um, month or so so throughout November it's probably gonna be a mixed bag of that as well because again like I said um I was touring a lot of October and this coming week we finish we have the last show for that tour then I've got two weeks off then we start rehearsals for Christmas time tour and then that'll go all throughout December um, plus work and just all that jazz so uploads will be I will still try to keep them on a daily basis but they may be semi daily um, you know maybe every other day or something just whenever I have something ready to upload and go and granted I have quite a few things just uploaded sitting private that I have not uh, made public yet that you know from streams a couple months ago lots of music reactions and I just haven't gotten around to like making thumbnails or um, doing descriptions because they're new artists that I haven't reacted to on the channel yet so then whenever I do start reacting to someone new on the channel I've got to go through a whole series of you know um, looking them up what are the right hashtags for this group um, what are their social media links what you know how can I tag this so that those fans find this video and all that kind of stuff and it's it's not really that long of a process but in my head it whenever I see a new video I'm like mm, this is a daunting process I'm gonna put this off until later mm, same thing whenever I'm starting a new series um so i do have some things that are just kind of sitting there waiting for me to like make descriptions and make thumbnails and i just haven't gotten to but again things will be scattered throughout the month but i will try to keep up with as much as i possibly can um same thing with patreon although patreon they get they get a little bit more well fed and more consistently because patreon edits especially for like um BLCers or just other series, K-dramas and whatnot you guys have me react to, it's just a lot easier on Patreon because I don't have to try and condense it down and, you know, appease the YouTube algorithm god so I, my video doesn't get struck. I can just put the full thing up there and, you know, call it a day, boom, bam, boom. So, you know, Patreon gets fed relatively well, although I try to do like one or two videos a day over on Patreon. Again, that sort of schedule has also been a little um, spotty over the last month and a half and i'll probably continue to be a little spotty um, go going into the next month but i will you know try my best to keep up with the things of things but um outside of that i'm still streaming on twitch twice a week ish again since i'm getting into busy season some of those streams have had to be either relocated to another day some weeks or just outright canceled because of just too many things i have going on but if nothing else is going on in my life, then I've got my Monday night and my Friday nights, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time streams. Um, so those will continue to happen. Again, usually whenever they get canceled, I'll announce it in the stream. Like, hey, sorry, I, I won't be here next stream, but I'll try and reschedule and whatnot. But those are still things that are happening. And on the streams is usually, that's where I'm getting most of my content, honestly, for YouTube right now. Um, I. I think I said in my last channel update video, I don't, I haven't had an abundance of time to just kind of like sit down and record stuff outside of the streams, um, just with again work shows and just being busy in general and drama llama. 
lot of my attention has been focused on Drama Llama over the last month, specifically a couple weeks. Yeah, most of my footage comes from the stream. So if you're not joining us on the streams over on Twitch, twitch.tv slash UncleToff704, join us Mondays and Friday nights if you have the ability to, because that's where, again, a lot of the footage is coming from. Um, that's the reason I started whatever new series I have started over the last couple weeks. So like we started Kidnap, we did start Jack and Joker and kind of put that off to the side. Uh, we got as far into Meet You at the Bottom as I possibly could before I was just like, I can't, I can't do this. Um, we started Every You, Every Me, and I've been meaning to go back to it. There's so many series that we've started I've been meaning to go back to. Um, ja um, Jack O'Frost, Minato's Laundromat, um, Mama Gogo, -Go, My Engineer, Secret Crush on You, that's where we've been watching that relatively consistently. Um, yeah, so there's lots lots of things just get thrown up in the air, and sometimes the, the chat votes, the last couple weeks they've been going wild and just random things have been winning, so, you know, if you have time to join us, feel free to join us, we have a good time over there. Um, but yes, as far as the polls that we um, went through the last couple weeks, for YouTube, uh, we went through three day, well, Two days worth of polls to get it down to a final three, and then I just let that final three poll go indefinitely until I had time to record this video. So I don't actually know what one. So I'm going over to my channel right now, going over to the community tab. So the final three, um, after we had six set of polls in the beginning, 24 series, got that down to, I think, six series. We did another three polls, and now we got to the final three was between um, Love for Love's Sake, the only one, and... I feel you linger in the air. So all of those series are series that I have already watched or mostly watched. So I feel you linger in the air. I finished out on Patreon months ago. Uh, Love for Love's Sake, I finished out on Patreon months ago. And the only one, we've been watching that over on my stream on Twitch. And we got through, I think, episode eight or nine last week. So we're pretty close to the end. So by the time I get to those YouTube edits, I'll be done with the series. But drum roll, or tofu roll, doo -doo -doo, the winner of the poll is, ooh, with 39% of the vote, the only one. So Love for Love's Sake was actually in the lead for like the first two days, and then they tied, and then it looks like only one just squeaked out the win. So only one has 39% of the vote, Love for Love's Sake has 36% of the vote, 605 votes as of looking at it right now. So. It was, a, it was a tight race, it was a tight race, and you know, I feel like Lingering There was there too, but those two were pretty much the ones leading neck and neck. Um, the only one is one that I've been enjoying immensely on the stream. Um, it's got to the point on the stream where like it kept winning the chat vote, and other people in the chat were like getting sick of it. They're like, I can't watch this now. I don't want to watch this anymore. Please stop make me watch this. So then we ended up taking a couple weeks break away from it, and it kept it stopped winning the polls. But then I think this last week they finally got to the point where they're like, I want to stop seeing this as an option. So I'm just going to vote for it so we can get it out, which is not the best rationale or best reasoning for you know, winning or, you know, watching it, but I enjoy it. I enjoy it immensely. I think it has been such a fantastically done series thus far. Granted, they could trip and stumble in the end. We still have, you know, quite a few episodes left to go, but I've enjoyed it immensely. So I'm happy to share that journey with you guys. So I still need to finish my Pit Babe um, YouTube edits. I have one more episode, one more episode, the uh, final episode of Pit Babe that I have to make that YouTube edit for. So I'm going to try and do that this week and or early next week. Um, and then once those are done and off my list, I will start trying to make the YouTube edits for the only one. I don't know how amazing those YouTube edits are going to be because the Korean series are scary when it comes to trying to make YouTube edits and not getting blocked and copyright stricken. Um, I'm pretty sure all of the copyright strikes I've gotten in the past over BL series were for Korean series. Um, and Korean series are the only ones who, like, I've gotten, like, warnings or things taken down for other series or other countries, but the Korean series are literally the only ones that have gone over to Patreon specifically and filed a claim saying, hey, they're using our stuff, I need you to take this down, and Patreon is like, hey, we have to take these videos down. That's when I would have those open to the public. So that's why my Korean reactions are still locked behind the Patreon paywall, the full unedited versions, because I just can't risk having that happen anymore. Um, I can't risk having these Korean companies coming and 
ever since I put it behind the paywall, the Korean companies can't see the you know the reaction. So there's nothing they really do about it. It's when I had it open to the public that they could go and click and say, hey, they're they're showing my stuff for free. Where it's like, mm. so yeah, I don't. It'll be fun. It will be. Oh wait, no, only one Taiwanese. It's not Korean. Sorry, I'm thinking love for love. Taiwanese. Everyone. Mm, some of the Taiwanese series can be a little iffy sometimes too i know the history series once they started uploading the youtube were getting a little shaky and wonky but whatever i'm gonna try and get to those um throughout the month i won't obviously finish those throughout the month but i will start those um through the month of november and then for my patrons uh, i gave you guys a poll for which of the series that I reacted to during the subathon back in june because i still have so much of that footage left um you guys would like me to release next last month you guys voted for old-fashioned cupcake so those have been edited and all released to um patreon at this point and this month the winner was about youth nice all right so then that means this month over on patreon i will get those edits for about youth started i'll probably finish them throughout the month because again the patreon edits are so easy i just make sure things are lined up and i throw it up i don't have to crop things down so i'll probably get those edited and um, uploaded throughout the month um and probably finish it throughout the, by before the end of the month so yeah there's that um i'll also be continuing um all the 700 series that my patrons have asked me to start <laughs> um because again it's my patrons who are on my guaranteed like reaction level they get one or two guaranteed reactions a month they're all using their guaranteed reactions to have me slowly go through like 800 different series so instead of me like binging through one at a time this patron's like i would like the first two episodes of lovely runner this one's like i would like the first two episodes or i would like the next two episodes of oh no here comes trouble i would like the next episode of interview with the vampire and the next episode of sensate i would like the next two episodes of every night i would like so like they keep having me start and slowly work my way through so many different series and just when i think that you know they're not going to give me a new series and let me finish one of the series someone else joins the patron at a guaranteed tier is like hey actually i'd like you to start this series all the way over here and i'm like ah granted they're all great series and i love them i'm having a good time watching them but there's so many to keep track of in my head so we're going through them so slowly at, at a snail's pace but you know what it is what it is um yeah like i said a lot of my time and attention the last month or so outside of performing has been focused on drama llama um if you've not heard me mention drama llama where have you been I, i've been talking about this for months i've been talking it's it's tattooed on my thigh like i've been talking about this for months um but if you're not aware what drama llama is it is an up-and-coming social media platform that is made by bl fans for bl fans it is going to be a bl fans just home love so it's currently in beta testing um if you're not actively or already beta testing it the links and stuff will be down in the description join us over there it's fantastic it's obviously still a work in progress it's not perfect but that's why it's beta testing you guys are helping us even i accidentally broke it like last week i didn't know but the the tech team was like oh yeah this this bug happened because topher deleted something like i didn't delete shit what do you mean so like it's not perfect but it is in the works and that is why we're beta testing that's why we have you guys here to help us make it better so that it is something that you guys want to use um in addition to that we've been releasing exclusive reactions over there so mine and synergic's reactions to spy realm are released every saturday exclusively on the uh, drama llama platform which reminds me i've got to get that next episode uploaded tonight Good job for reminding me, Topher. Um, and then my Love in the Air reactions that I did during the last subathon um, are going to be released to the Drama Llama platform every Thursday. So this last Thursday, or yesterday, I should say, Halloween, woo, spooky time, um, we released both my initial reaction that I had on YouTube from two years ago and my new reaction to episode one that I did during the subathon back in June. So both of those reactions to episode one are available exclusively on the Drama Llama platform. And then every Thursday, the next episode's reaction will get released. So 
If you like Loving the Air or Spy Realm and you want to see mine or mine and Synergic's reactions, head over to Drama Llama. Um, they will be over there. Um, and yeah, I've spent a lot of time just getting content made for the Drama Llama YouTube channel. Because on the growth team right now, there's only three members. Um, one of our social media people who is very good with just social media and short form content handles a lot all of that stuff. Um, we've got another one who is great with research and um, interviews and just writing articles handles that and then I handle the long form content um, and a lot of meme creation but yeah the, the YouTube content that you see on the drama on the YouTube channel that's mostly me um, at least when it comes to like the editing scripting and all that kind of stuff so that's where a lot of my focus and tension has been in my free time over the last couple of weeks just trying to get that stuff created and honestly there are videos that i've wanted to create for the longest time on my own channel like a lot of ranking videos or like top 10 this that the other so like for last week for halloween we had you know 10 or might have been 18 15 i remember um just a collection of good series to watch for Halloween, good BL series to watch for Halloween. Um, this week we'll have, you know, 10 side ships who stole the show um, that are coming out. And we've just got a bunch of different list videos in the works. So it's stuff that I've wanted to do on my channel for the longest time, but I just never got around to because of how time consuming it is. So now I'm doing it for the Drama Llama channel and I'm enjoying myself, but it is a time consuming thing. So that's again, where some of my attention is gone and why, you know, my own channel has not been as consistent as it normally is but yeah that 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 is pretty much the thing i've babbled enough i don't know why in my head every time i sit down to do a channel update video i'm like tofer you have like three things to say it's going to take you seven minutes tops and here we are at like the 17 and a half minute mark <sighs> it happens every time but yeah those are the things so to summarize i'll be spotty with some of my uploads throughout the month of november but i will try my best um i will be busy with work and shows um the youtube edits that we're going to be doing as far as bl series um after i upload the last episode of not kim portion pit babe i'll start my youtube edits for the only one um on patreon i'll start those edits for about youth um, I'll still be reacting to the 700 series my patrons have asked me to start. Um, I still Twitch stream Mondays and Fridays, mostly. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to stop babbling so I can go get some dinner. Um, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Love ya! Mwah.